A defiant Rusty Bowers tells me he won't be bullied after leaders of the Arizona Republican Party slapped the House Speaker with a censure. Bowers was widely praised for his integrity when he was pressured by the Trump White House to lie about the 2020 election. Now Bowers is paying a steep price. The censure is a formal vote of disapproval that has no real impact, but the party Bowers has belonged to all his adult life is telling GOP voters to dump him in the August 2nd primary. It was a riveting moment. And it is a tenet of my faith that the Constitution is divinely inspired. Arizona House Speaker Rusty Bowers telling a national audience why he wouldn't violate his oath of office to help Donald Trump overturn an election. For me to do that because somebody just asked me to is foreign to my very being. I, I, I will not do it. Bowers now says he knew there'd be a price to pay. These people didn't turn into thugs yesterday. They've been exercising this vindictiveness for years. These people are Chairwoman Kelly Ward and the Trump wing of the Arizona Republican Party, a party the 69-year-old Bowers has belonged to since he could vote. Ward announced on Twitter late Tuesday that Bowers had been censured by party leadership. His list of alleged transgressions was long, largely not going along with legislation that the Trump wing wanted. You can beat me, but you're not going to bully me. I'm not going to be bullied. Bowers now faces a tough primary against the Trump-endorsed candidate who believes the devil rigged the 2020 election. This is a real conspiracy headed up by the devil himself. Bowers has a reputation as a capital C conservative on fiscal, social, and education legislation, but he's broken with the party over Trump. That's what this is about. It's payback for diso disobeying idiocy. Consultant Chuck Coughlin has worked closely with top Arizona Republicans. He says Bowers is the most virtuous person he's ever met in 40 years in politics.